G'day everybody, welcome to the channel. Today we're going to have a quick look at the Star Wars Character Encyclopedia 2020 edition. So this book comes with an exclusive Darth Maul. The one seen in the Solo movie, so he's got some new prints on him there. And just a really cool looking Darth Maul figure. Got some feet printing as well, and yeah, he looks really cool. Got his double bladed lightsaber. So let's go ahead and uh, take a look at this book. Which is really cool. Love these DK books. First page. We've got table of contents. Uh, quite a few parts of this book, which is cool. So I'll go through everything fairly quick just to give you a look at each page. Some cool droids there, 3 PO droids. Love that figure. Cool to see some new variations on the a new variation on the battle droid there. So there's a previous Darth Maul. Really great figure. I think it's about time we got a, a re-release of Count Dooku as well. Haven't had one for a while. Awesome, some clone trippers. Plocoon. Everyone's going nuts over this at the moment. So that's the previous one there. And the new one comes with some uh, differences. So we're not, I've got the, the black sort of hip piece belt type thing there. Awesome. Sarge, General Grievous, which is a great, awesome figure. Ah! These figures freak me out. But anyone who grew up with them, uh, they'd still love them. Cool, Shark T, that looks awesome. And Hondo, we need another Hondo. Big time. Ayla Secura, we've got plenty there. Oh no, no, sorry. Cad Bane, that's cool. Embo, he was a bounty hunter through the Clone Wars as well. Oh, Aura Singh. I would love to see an updated Aura Singh. And Savage Oppressed, that would be cool. Some awesome droids. Droids are always cool. To get new prints. Haven't seen another Palpatine like that since the original Palpatine's Arrest either, which is a great set. Love this Anakin figure there. So we're getting into some solo stuff here. We just did have some cool figures. Love that hair piece. I actually really, really like that droid, uh, that uh, trooper there too. I think the Imperial Snow Trooper is my favourite trooper of all time, just for some reason, I don't know, it's just so cool. Being a kid when the figures come out, that was just the coolest photo. And uh, yeah, still got fond memories of getting my vintage Star Wars figures back in the day. Empress Nest, cool figure. So here's our new Darth Maul. Now we're into the Rebels. Let's just move on. Admiral Thrawn, that's pretty cool. And this guy was pretty cool. That was a cool figure. And we're getting into some Rogue One. These books are really great quality. The pages are nice and smooth and the amount of detail they put into these books is really Really great. Yeah, I'm surprised how many of these sets I actually have. I've got more than I thought I did. 
these figures, sorry. Uh, so, Beast Musician, Figure and Dan and the Modal Nodes, Greedo, a great figure, a great character. I really love that it's easy to make these if you actually don't have the the proper versions. You just chuck the head on a stormtrooper. That's cool. But uh, right, that was one of the first books I got. One of the first DK books I ever bought, and it's another exclusive there with the character encyclopedia from I think 2013. Love that figure there too. And this guy is just a cool looking figure. But this, good timing. That is my favorite, probably Stormtrooper variant. I just love it. Bosk. Great Lando figure there, which I've managed to snap up in the Cloud City for $200 off, which was great. And the best Luke Skywalker figure ever, in my opinion. Gamorrean Guard looks awesome. Boosh. I love these, uh, the Jabba's henchmen, they're really cool. Bit of a funny print with this. If they had printed on the side of the legs, that would have looked a lot better, but I know that's not a it's a costly sort of thing to do, but I still wish I had that figure. Awesome. Alright, that's where the book ends. <laughs> Just joking, sorry. That's where the saga ends. Oh god, I can't stop. Anyway, Lego figures are always great. Regardless of what you think of the movies. I was very excited to get Finn in the back to tank suit. A lot more excited than I was seeing the actual movie, but that's not what we're talking about here. We're talking about Lego and it looks really cool, all these figures. I love some of the new designs of the characters that uh, I really didn't even know much about. Love that. I wish he did more. I wish he was as awesome as he was supposed to be. But we'll just keep quiet there. We'll keep quiet about that. Yeah, that is cool. That is a cool figure. Even this guy, I really like that design. And it's Star Wars. I mean, how many figures have we had made on characters that don't even have a second of screen time? So character design in Star Wars is mostly always really, really cool. Anyway, that's it, guys. Just a quick look. There's the back of the book. So I picked this up today at Big W, uh, $24 on the run for essential goods, but uh, yeah, I find that quite, quite essential myself. Anyway, hope you're all taken care. Talk soon. Bye everybody. Cheers.